Some breaking news at noon, a prominent South Carolina lawyer accused of trying to orchestrate his own suicide as well as commit insurance fraud is back in jail, this time in Orange County. Alex Murdow is now charged with stealing insurance settlements from the family of his dead housekeeper. He was arrested this morning at an Orlando drug rehab facility where lawyers say he has spent the past six weeks. The family's housekeeper, Gloria Satterfield, died in 2018. Her family says the Murdows never paid them more than $500,000 owed in a death settlement. But that's just one of the twists in this story, which has received national attention for weeks. Back in June, Murdow's wife and 22-year-old son were shot and killed at the couple's, couple's property outside of Charleston. That investigation is ongoing. Then the 53-year-old admitted to attempting to orchestrate his own suicide days after the family's legendary law firm accused him of stealing money. Prosecutors say Murdow hired 61-year-old Curtis Smith to shoot him in the head with hopes of leaving a $10 million insurance settlement to his surviving son. 48 Hours spoke to Smith to get his side of the story, part of an interview that aired on CBS Mornings. Down there with, like this. He said, yeah, you got to take care of this. And I said, well, I can't do it. And he told me he turned his head. I just grabbed his arm, put it behind his head, took the gun from him. When the alleged plot failed, Murdow told police he was shot while changing a flat tire on his Mercedes. He then entered himself into rehab for opioid addiction. Murdow will be extradited back to South Carolina.